again we will proceed to find the the sail so the same given data so we will find the lower boundary minus lang na ito na ito ng 0.5 so that is 20 1.5 18.5 19.5 and 12.5 and this one is 9.5 kung yung frequency unahin natin dito pwede rin so yung last frequency natin ilagay natin dito then 5 plus 8 that is 13 13 plus 5 that is 18 18 plus 10 that is 28 28 plus 2 is 30 dapat ang ang cumulative frequency dito sa taas equivalent yan sa total frequency or the value of n so question find d sub 8 d sil 8 so we will use this formula so first the same with quartile hanapin muna natin yung k times n over 10 d sil so meaning 10 so k what is the value of k that is 8 so 8 times value of n that is 30 ta over 10 so 8 times 30 that is okay that is 24 240 over 10 so that is 24 so that is the value of k times n over 10 so ito yung pinaka importante 24 then 24 lies between this one 18 and 28 but take note to find the decile interval that is greater than to 24 so greater, greater than 24 is 28 so ito na yung decile interval so dito na kayo naka base lahat ito dito na kayo naka base lahat so we will use this formula I substitute natin so that is equals lower boundary sa so decile class that is 18.5 plus k times n over 10 that is 24 subtract baba sa 28 is 18 over ano yung frequency is 10 then interval is 3 next simplify 18.5 plus 24 divide minus 18 that is equivalent to 6 over 10 times 3 next 18.5 plus 6 times 3 that is 18 divide it by 10 so 18.5 plus 18 divide 10 that is 1.8 1.8 then 18.5 plus 1.8 that is equivalent to 20.3 so ito na yung decile sub 8 tingnan natin yung value 20.3 dito pa rin natin yan makita sa decile interval okay so ito yung sagot natin 20.3